Katie James Photography. <laughs> the problem though is everybody assumes that you want to do a photo shoot with full sunlight and that is actually the most difficult to shoot with. Um, for example, right now it's overcast. You can't even tell which direction the sun is coming from unless you're really paying attention. And the lighting is much better. Um, usually when I get clients, they're going, oh, let's, you know, let's do one in the afternoon and the sun is at its highest and there's no cloud cover. It'll be perfect, right? Not in the slightest because what's gonna happen is any photos that aren't gonna be under a tree or shaded in the building or something like that are gonna create raccoon eyes. You're gonna have shadows coming from your nose, you're gonna have them coming from your chin. It just, it washes everything out. The grass, even if it was a really vibrant green, will turn yellow of all things. Um, just something to keep in mind when you're picking a time for your photo shoots. Um, now, we can work around that. If it's plan a photo shoot, think of the time. Um, best time for photo shoots is what we call the golden hour and it's about an hour or two before sunset when everything starts getting a really nice hue. The sun is usually less bright but just enough to give off a really good color. Um, if you look up golden hour you'll see what I mean. It's, it's, pretty, it's a pretty big difference compared to one in the afternoon. So. If you need any kind of photos, uh, seniors, family, weddings, you name it, I do custom shoots. All my prices are customized for you. There's no sticker, copy paste method to anything. And we can have a lot of fun. So get in touch. Love you. <laughs> Goodbye and thank you for watching.